Over 30 years of experience and approaching 30,000 installations worldwide, all attractively finished with unmatched internal stability and excellent performance. Retaining walls, bridge abutments, waterway structures, industrial, commercial and residential applications, highway and railway structures, dams and truck dumps. You see us everywhere. We are the reinforced earth company. With over 150 million square feet of reinforced earth applications erected since 1968, the economy, safety and reliability of our approach are well recognized. And that is why we continue to be the solution of choice throughout the world for owners, civil engineers and contractors, people like you. Reinforced earth is a coherent gravity mass engineered to resist applied loads. It consists of compacted granular soil and galvanized steel reinforcements layered behind attractive and stable concrete facing panels. The layering of installation of compacted earth and steel reinforcing strips ensures internal stability of the mass and conveniently allows equipment to operate on top of any layer of backfill during the construction process. Let's take a quick look at a typical reinforced earth application to give you an idea of just how straightforward our installation process is. An important aspect of a reinforced earth application is that the contractor actually performs the installation. We provide the knowledge and expertise, materials, plans and specifications, everything you need, all provided under the guidance and review of professional engineers. And we work with the on-site contractors to ensure they are familiar and comfortable with our procedures manual. But your own construction team performs the work, saving you money and time, and ensuring the application is fully and completely integrated into the remainder of your project. The reinforced earth installation process consists of four primary activities. Planning, materials handling and storage, the construction process, and finishing. Let's take a look. The Reinforced Earth Company works closely with contractors to develop feasibility studies and preliminary cost estimates for their projects. Contractors then provide comprehensive site surveys with which we develop detailed installation plans. These plans specify the entire construction process including materials amounts and delivery schedules, construction specifications, site drawings, a thorough quality control procedure manual, and all contract documents. Once all plans are approved by the owner and the construction site is prepared to receive and store all reinforced earth provided materials, the process can begin. First, the contractor excavates and prepares the site, installing drainage control measures if required and positioning a cast-in-place or precast concrete leveling pad to support the first course of panels. It is important that this leveling pad meet project specifications, for a small grade variation at the bottom can lead to larger variations at the top of the structure. Additionally, it is preferred that a suitable location is provided as close to the construction site as practical for material storage. And second, a time is scheduled to deliver all reinforced earth provided materials, including the precast concrete facing panels, joint material and adhesive, galvanized steel reinforcing strips, bearing blocks and shims, structural hardware, and one set of panel lifting devices. It is assumed that the contractor has all required materials lifting and moving devices and tools and equipment to effectively complete the construction process. Upon delivery, facing panels may be placed directly into the structure or temporarily stacked at the work site. Care must be taken to ensure facing panels are not damaged or stained during storage. The steel reinforcing strips must be stacked above ground and the rolls of filter cloth must be sheltered out of direct sunlight in a dry location. The Reinforced Earth Company has developed materials handling and safety procedures to assist contractors planning, construction efforts, and quality control. Now that the plans have been made, the site fully prepared, and the materials delivered, the construction process can begin. 
Keep in mind that as contractor, you are responsible for constructing the reinforced earth structure, meaning you are responsible for following all engineering specifications, proper materials handling, safely bracing all facing panels during construction, providing fall protection, and employing proper tools and techniques to ensure stability and durability in the final product. A reinforced earth company technical advisor will be on site during the initial construction effort to ensure that you understand all required construction and quality control procedures. The initial course of facing panels is positioned on the concrete leveling pad according to project specifications. Initially altering half height and full height facing panels to establish our unique and stable structure. These facing panels are securely set and braced with wooden wedges and clamps. The filter cloth, which restricts migration of backfill through the structure facing, is attached with adhesive to the back of the facing panels, and the worksite is backfilled and compacted to just below the first course of panel tie strips. Steel reinforcing strips are then connected to the panels and the site is again backfilled and compacted to just below the tops of the half-height panels. Bearing blocks are positioned and the second course of panels is set into place. This simple process of backfilling and compacting in lifts, connecting reinforcing strips, applying filter cloth, placing bearing blocks and setting facing panels is repeated again and again until the full height of the structure is achieved. Of course, local site considerations and project specifications may determine variations to these procedures, but the basic approach remains consistent. Note, too, that the Reinforced Earth Company operates nationally. We're well versed in adjusting our designs and construction processes as necessary to individual state DOT guidelines. Finally, the job is finished by setting top panels, removing all wedges and clamps, and installing concrete coping, traffic barriers, or cast-in-place concrete as specified. And with that, you have a completed reinforced earth installation, a structure designed for a 75 to 100 year lifespan requiring only minimal maintenance that will serve well into future generations. So what makes a reinforced earth installation unique? It is the simplicity and stability of the design. It is the experience of detailed and accurate project planning. It is the strength and durability of the construction materials. It is the integrity of the approach. And it is the inherent structural soundness of the reinforced earth application that brings owners and contractors like you to the reinforced earth company. Through detailed feasibility studies and cost-effective planning, through precise material specifications, handling and storage, through precision construction techniques and quality control, your reinforced earth structure, be it a retaining wall, a bridge abutment, or a dam, will prove to be the most economical, safe, and reliable component in your construction project.